always tough when you draw that high-level wrestler who has a lifetime of experience in a one-on-one -on -one competitive situation. Prevailing wisdom is he'll have the wrestling advantage in this one. Tonight. As his dad said, the moment he introduced him to the sport, he knew that he was made to be a wrestler. The kid slept in his head here. He only wants to wrestle, and by doing that, he puts you in danger. He's constantly in your face, constantly trying to dig at your gas tank. He goes from transition to transition, single to double to high crotch. It does not matter the attack, he just knows that he will give you so much to process in terms of the wrestling that eventually he will get you to the ground. Do you ever sleep in your head here? I sleep in my head here. All the time. All the time. All right. Big one for him here tonight. Let's get to it. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem at the bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, some differences in height and reach. And now for the Ladies particulars, here's Bruce Buffett. This is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, make his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 151 pounds. Fighting out of New York, the problem. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up and we are underway. It's a danger that is not worth risking. It is something that you don't want to play with. This grappler is that good. When this fight gets to the ground, you enter his world, especially when it looks like you hold the advantage. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Relax, relax. Keep your hands up. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. I mean, he's cutting them down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Back and forth we go here. Right hook. 
to the head block. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, just misses with the kick. Just over two minutes to go. Beautiful hook. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Big kick. And they separate. Throwing that jab, no good. Nice punch lands over the top. Got the single collar tie. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. 30 seconds now to go in the round. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. You don't really stand after you take a head shoot like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with a the punch there. Accuracy at its best. It's a beautiful, fast, quick jab with meaning. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Lee. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jack right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Beautiful kick. from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Big kick lands. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, nice. Beautiful leg kick. Upper cut lands for him. Nice connection with a punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Real quick leg kick. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. And he landed the right hand there. Good night if that landed. You gotta get this 
All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. And they separate. Nice punch to land. Round three next. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. that kick as well. A big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. on that offering. Big head kick land. That shot blocked by Lee. Got clip with the right hand. Nice head kick. Changed the complexion of this one. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds. And it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter. Take the judges out of it. So his legendary chin holds up despite getting knocked down in that previous round. DC, take us through the highlight. He's as tough as they come. There has not been a guy that can take shots like this. Most times the night would be over. And gladly, gladly over after you take a shot like this. But this man is just too tough. Some people say he's too tough for his own good. He would not agree with you. He wants to fight. for five five-minute rounds. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, nice right Vicious hand. combo there. That is a shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. 
I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talk to your toughness. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Big right hook coming. It's blocked. Man, what a and fight. Both guys really throwing with authority. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Single collar tie. Can't take many of those. You better check. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Lee gets caught with that punch. Well, there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether it run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was. Diving punch lands. And he's back up. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Trying to establish that jab once again. Hardy closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Beautiful punch. down, potentially five to go. All right, so he gets knocked down, but not out. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. A huge round on the other side. He had him hurt very bad. He found the shot. He got exactly what he wanted. When he saw the opening, he jumped on it, and he hurt his opponent very bad. If he can get back to that one more time, he may end the night. strikes he's making up for lost time here shot to the body connects and that bears watching that's gonna hurt this opponent he has a commitment to kick it tonight and it shows look at him working at trying to shut the liver down just Whoa! Unable to connect with the right hand there. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Oh, my goodness! <laughs> yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighters saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, 
punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At one minute, 48 seconds of round number five. Playing the winner by knockout, the 